happy day 16. Have you ever had any everything that could go right actually go right for you? I wanted to point this out because I feel like this little action that I'm taking every night of writing down a win for the day is helping me significantly. Jay, have, Jay and I have always gone to bed and done our gratitude list where we say three things we're thankful for and then we add it on to the why are we thankful for it to give it some more meaning behind it. But recently I was noticing that Jay would have one bad moment in his day and he would call it a bad day. And I was trying to explain to him that one bad moment in your day doesn't make it a bad day, you know? Just like even one good thing in your day doesn't even make it a great day, you know what I'm saying? So fast forward to today, um, lots and lots of things going on. I had a PL on my way home yesterday, I think. I was on E, and I don't know about y'all, but I stretched that E all the way to, as, far, as far as I can. And then I also needed groceries, but it was also a day where we had our PL. Um, I'd have to go back to school to help with rehearsal, pick up Jay, get back home within an hour, pray that traffic was okay, get to counseling by five, and then live my life after, you know what I'm saying? I really didn't want to go to Aldi after, but anyway, so let me get to what happened today. So I dropped Jay off at school, and my PL ended up only being 15 minutes away, so I was able to get gas, so that was one less stressor off for the afternoon of having to rely on if traffic was going to work with us or against us. Then, because it was a PL, I keep saying PL like y'all know this, professional development, professional learning, whatever you want to call it. But because we had that, we actually had an hour lunch break. I don't remember last time I had an hour lunch break. Scratch that, it was during my last PL. <laughs> Mind you, prior to this, I had gone to bed really late. I didn't get a lot of sleep. I had already decided that I was going to be taking a nap during my lunch break. There was an Aldi 12 minutes down the street. I literally grocery shopped during my lunch break. And I had my bags in the car because I had organized my, my car during one of my 75 hard days. And it was incredible. And I... I got into bed and I just realized like today was just one of those days where like all the things that could go right went right. I feel like this is a mindset shift that is happening because of this challenge. Because I'm being intentional with pointing out my wins, I saw how much of a win of a day today was and how it could have been insane. It could have been crazy. But things like really worked out and I know it's not always going to be that way. But finding a win no matter what has been a game changer for me. 